truth with the offense. Oh, Brock Lesnar unable to be contained. This is the type of attack that just wears down an opponent. Yeah, and you can see it working right here. You know, one thing that Brock Lesnar has going for him is that he doesn't ever seem to get tired. I mean, the man has as much energy as he has muscle, and that can make him an unbelievable dawning opponent. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. No kidding, that shot came out of nowhere. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. So damaging. He's got to be careful not to go to the well too many times. You do remember wells, don't you, Michael? Not really, but you are from Tennessee, so I get your reference. You still use them. Yeah, but I don't go there too many times. You know, Michael, Lesnar can get rattled if you catch him off guard. It's not easy to do, but if you can strike Brock Lesnar when his defenses are down and stun him, sometimes he's vulnerable. So if you get that clean shot on him, you better go in for the kill right away before he can fully recover. The offensive Brock Lesnar is working well right now. Sickening thud as his body is driven to the mat. You know, if there was ever a man built to be a WWE superstar, it has to be Brock Lesnar. He's got the body, the attitude, the intensity. He was a champion in college and added a WWE title to his resume within months after joining the company. I agree. The Beast was born for this, Cole. I won't argue with that. He is a ruthless competitor with the skills to match. But sometimes, I might take issue with Brock's tactics. Like the time at the Royal Rumble when he nearly killed Big Show with a steel chair even after Brock had already won the match. Still, there's